Trigger King RC, event number three of the 2023 Summer Series Pro Mod Racing Bracket number one. Taking a look at qualifying highlights, two runs, one in each lane for each truck with the best time going towards seeding for the event. These are our top three and the top of them all. Taurus, Jeremy Mark setting the tone with a 4.66 in qualifying as our top qualifier. Taking a look at some of the other qualifying results. Moving into round number one of racing, we start off with a 16-17 matchup, Rotten Candy Apple and Bigfoot 13. Bigfoot 13 with a great run, moving the truck into round number two, where he'll face off with the number one qualifier. It's a classic matchup, Bigfoot versus USA 1. A big jump for Bigfoot, a great turn, and taking the victory, USA 1 comes vaulting in, crashing. How fitting. Right back on the line, Keith Voigt in Retro Bigfoot, facing off with Zeus. Zeus rolling a wheelie over the first roller, but looking smooth and taking the victory. Yeah. We the People, facing off against Underpowered. Underpowered with a jump. We the People with a good turn and holds underpowered on his hip for the victory. Our next pair, Equalizer Chris Parrish and Rotten Apple Doug Welker. These two have similar driving styles and are always a great race. Equalizer looking all out of shape and Welker is going to take the victory in the Rotten Apple. Wannabe rock star Isaac Ankrum from Illinois against Awesome Kong. Troy Haas from Colorado. Oh, big jump for wannabe rock star, but he's all out of shape. Haas, smooth and steady, takes the victory as wannabe rock star charges hard at the finish line. Ford Monster against Manic. This is the 7 and 26 matchup. Manic, the number seven qualifier, looking very smooth, taking the victory. Monster Energy, the freestyle RC chassis with Isaac Ankrum driving this week against Troy Haas in Mad Dog. Monster Energy taking a smooth victory on that one. Ballistic Orange against Big A's Wrecking. A big jump for Big A's Wrecking. Ballistic Orange takes the lead in the corner and powers on to victory. Our final pair in round number one. 11, Indominus against 22, Pancreatic Crusher Mike Bufka. Indominus with a big jump. Pancreatic Crusher with a great turn. But Indominus takes the victory as Pancreatic Crusher missed an obstacle with the front axis. Moving into round number two, it's the number one qualifier, Taurus against number 17, Bigfoot 13. Bigfoot 13 still looking lucky, taking out the number one qualifier. Next, the 8-9 matchup, Angels Bigfoot versus Zeus. Bigfoot with trouble in the corner, giving the victory to the man known as Iron Janes in Zeus. Number four, Sudden Impact against number 13, We the People. Drivers ready? Yep. Watch the light. 
A little bit of a jump by We The People, but a great corner by Sudden Impact gives him the victory with Sudden Impact moving on to round number three. Careless Whisper, the custom tube frame chassis from Mike Buffka and Brass Ring Fabrication against Rotten Apple, Doug Welker. Welker misses the corner entry and gives the victory to Careless Whisper. Hellion, the number two qualifier against Awesome Kong, the number 18 qualifier. A big jump for Hellion, but he's all out of shape and completely misses the corner entry. And they're both out of shape on the final straightaway. Offsetting penalties, the win will go to Hellion. That was a sloppy race. Next up, Monster Energy, Ankrum against Manic, Chris Hackinson. A little bit of a jump by Manic. Great corner. Easily taking the victory, Manic moves into round number three. Firestone Bigfoot, Bob C. Chandler on the line against Ballistic Orange, Chris Blank. Firestone with a big jump. It's close on the final straightaway. We're gonna have to take a look at the TK replay. Two different approaches to the corner, but power down on the final straightaway, momentum on Firestone Bigfoot's side, and the victory goes to Firestone Bigfoot. Our final pair in round number two, Tiger versus Indominus, a battle of the beasts. Little jump for Indominus, but he misses the corner. Hackinson with another great corner, and the Tiger takes down the dinosaur. <laughs> Round number three, Bigfoot 13 against Zeus, Iron Aaron James. A huge jump for Zeus. And the magic runs out for Bigfoot 13. Zeus takes the victory with a thrust of lightning. <laughs> a 4-5 matchup, Sudden Impact and Careless Whisper on the line. Careless Whisper good into the corner and then misses the exit. And Sudden Impact takes the victory moving to the semifinals. This is the number two and number seven matchup, Hellion versus Manic. Drivers ready? Yep. Watch the light. Oh. Hackinson with a great turn, but Hellion gets the power down on the straightaway and takes the victory at the line. Our final pair in round number three, Firestone Bigfoot and Tiger. Hackinson right back up. He was just out on the track and he gets the jump on Bigfoot. But Bigfoot powers down on the straightaway and leads him to the finish line, moving into the semifinals. The final four is set. Zeus in sudden impact, Hellion and Bigfoot. Drivers ready? Yep. Watch the light. A tight battle. It was nasty after the finish line, but he got there first. Sudden Impact takes the victory and moves on to the finals. Aaron James with both of his trucks in the semifinals. He's back on the line. Hellion versus Bob C. Chandler and Firestone Bigfoot. Firestone with the jump. But a little bit wide in the corner and Hellion leads it to victory. Moving on to the finals. So the finals is set. Number two, Hellion against number four, Sudden Impact. Yep. Watch the light. Even 
coming off the start. Hellion with a great corner. And he leads all the way down the straightaway to the finish line. Hellion takes bracket number one of Pro Mod competition at Trigger King event number three. It's incredible to say this, but this is the first bracket victory for Iron Aaron James in the Hellion. Congratulations, Aaron. He's put himself into a great position as we move into bracket number two. He leads the points for the day as he tries for the overall title based on combined points for both brackets in the day. We'll see what he can do next time out. As we take a look at the current point standings, it's tight at the top. The top four separated by only four points. Incredible action. It's going to be a knockdown drag out battle all season long in the Pro Mod division. We'd like to thank all of our sponsors that make it happen here at Trigger King as well as you as the fan. Join us next time on Trigger King.